what's up, it's your girl, Karen Nicole, and welcome back to my channel. I got the light turned down low, and I'm on the bed. So, doing quarantine is kind of hard to date, but I have some date ideas for you to do during the quarantine. You can still date, you can still get your food back, girl, and still be safe. So, if you want to see what I have in store, then keep on watching. You know you want this for this. All right, you guys, so I have five cute little date ideas where you can still practice social distances and still get your little groove on. Yeah, it's just a little bit. So the first thing that I would suggest is streaming the same movie at the same time from your perspective homes. So what you do is you decide on your favorite streaming service. It may be Netflix. It may be Hulu. It may be something even totally different. So you decide on which one you want to use, and then you decide on a movie to watch. You get on the phone, and you guys start this movie at the same time. That way, it's almost like you're watching the movie together. How often is that? Date number two. Which one is, is my favorite? So, I call it the car date. No, we're not in the same car. We pull up in our prospective cars. Preferably at a nice location. We have a nice lake here. Uh, some of you may have nice parks or things like that. So you both pull up, you sit on your cars, and you talk to each other. So here you are in the same area in a beautiful location, but you're still six feet apart because I want my car. He sit on his car. And we have a great little conversation. You can bring food and add in it. You can have a drink, but you're still safe. You're out in the open so you can get some fresh air and you're having a date. So, that's really, really cool. Hey, so if you're trying to date me, that's your date for me. Come on with it now. <laughs> All right, date number three. So, date number three is another social distancing event where you're actually in different places. A lot of us now have iPhones. <laughs> you move to the iPhone game if you don't. It's okay. Get you one. But you can always get all cute and fancy for a FaceTime video. Pop on some lashes. Some um, lip gloss, put your little earrings in. I love me a good pair of hoops. Yes, it pulls my whole look together. And get on it and FaceTime your honey. He's there, you're here, you're safe, and you're still enjoying each other's company. Yes. But take it back to the old school. When you used to be on that house phone, that cord wrapped around your legs, you upside down, you in the middle of the floor, all types of things. Go back to that and get you some FaceTime video dates in now, honey. Date four would be to go out and actually work out together or just enjoy outside you may want to go to a park and do a hike you may want to go and walk around a lake you may want to go out and play basketball because you are exercising and working out you are fighting that coronavirus at the same time because they say lots and lots of exercise will help you with the coronavirus so if you're out and you're being active just make sure that you're practicing some things if you feel safer with your mask on put a mask on but they said that we can gather as long as there's not more than 10 people so you guys go out and enjoy yourselves just the two of you no other distractions don't be out in the open with a bunch of other people just the two of you guys having a nice little fun outside activity where you're working up a sweat getting all that heat into your body killing the coronavirus but still having so much fun and girls keep it cute get you some cute bike shorts a cute little tank top and hoops yeah, I like hoops, if y'all haven't noticed. <laughs> now, we're on to date five. Date five takes me back all the way, all the way, 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 Um, Last time I did this, I was actually dating somebody in the military, and I was a younger girl. Send letters. I think that is the cutest thing ever. If you want to just do text messages back and forth, that's fine. But a letter, because you never know when you're going to get it. Spray it down with your favorite perfume, guys. Spray it down with your favorite cologne and send a handwritten letter. Like, come on, gosh, that is so freaking cute. You can even take it up a notch, send flowers to each other, send each other silly little gifts. It doesn't really matter as long as you guys are doing something where you guys can communicate with each other and show each other how much you truly care for each other during this time, even if you can't be together. So, Get your practice, your social distance in, but also keep your love life intact, you guys, okay? And if you're single, hey, try some of these out with some new people. 
not the one on one, but some of these social distancing ones. <laughs> and find you a new mate if you're single. But if you're with someone and you all are living apart, try some of these out and see how it works out for you. And if you try these dates, let me know how you did that down below, okay? So until the next time, you guys, check out one of these videos that are floating right here next to me. Check out my mother's page that I'm actually going to link in my description box below because she is on fire. Yes, she is. I'm actually going to steal one of her videos. She don't know it yet. Um, yeah, and just make sure you come back, you guys. Until next time. Bye.